We feel like that we want to make an impact on our local community. And you can't make an impact on your community if you're not reflective of that community. I moved here in March of 2010, and the fall of that year, uh, I attended our mayor, Mayor Nancy Harris, State of the City address. Uh, her mayoral address that year was on diversity, and she made a statement that there are 57 different languages spoken at Duluth High School. I, I couldn't imagine 57 languages at our local high school. I didn't even know there were 57 languages in the world, much less in our community. And so shortly thereafter, I did a sermon entitled Project 57, where I challenged our church that if we're the first Baptist church of Duluth, uh, we're not just the first church of, of Anglo uh, Duluth, but we're to make a difference among 57 different language groups in our area. So it means we need to learn how to make a difference in those cultural groups and how we can embrace them and how we can introduce them to the gospel of Jesus Christ. We take opportunities to be able to celebrate together and to learn from each other. Uh, we'll celebrate uh, India, India Independence Day on August the 15th or the Sunday closest thereof. We do that with other cultures. In Hispanic cultures, we celebrate Posada, a uh, Hispanic celebration of Christmas on the on the week after Christmas in which the three kings bring gifts instead of Santa Claus. We just learned today of two additional countries that are represented in our fellowship that now brings our total to 35 countries uh, that are attending or are members here at First Baptist Church. Uh, so we are beginning to see the diversity within our local family of faith.